Hey guys, Rip Fletching here. We're gonna do a, a kind of a opening, but I've already opened it. I like a kid in a candy store. I got some broadheads. I ordered some broadheads from Bishop Archery. I've seen these things all over the internet. Me being a traditional archery guy, just archery fanatic, I had to get in there and test them myself. So I ordered up a bunch. I gotta show you. First of all, they come very well packaged. There was a lot of padding in here. Um, the, the individual packaging that the broadheads are in are well made. Um, he wrote me little notes. So, and you know, I kind of understand you, you, these are not cheap. They're not Walmart era uh, broadheads. You spend the kind of money to get a quality product. It's nice when they give you that additional information, give you that feedback. They're on the internet. They'll communicate with you. Um, awesome product. So I've got several uh, and I'll be testing them in future videos. Uh, I'll be shooting, hopefully I'll be getting a buffalo here pretty soon and we'll be doing some broadhead test on those scapulas. You're not going to be shooting anything in North America bigger than a buffalo. Maybe if you go to Africa you can get in some, you know, something there. But anyway, so let's, let's get into the broadheads. Um, these are CNC, so they're not, um, you know, they're, they're definitely not that cheap, uh, I don't want to say foreign made, cheap made broadheads. They are very, very nice. And this one's called the Pipeline. It's CNC machined. You can see that. And um, these are these are all patent pended or, or, or patented products. <clears throat> this one is the ultra high end SR stainless steel. I'm not a steel guy. I can't tell you a lot of the details about steel. This one's 125 grain, <clears throat> non-vented. It is um, a one and one eighth inch cut. Put that one there. Okay. This is the Bishop broadhead, which you've been seeing a lot of on the internet. These things are, uh, everybody's gobbling these up and shooting. So they're quite the, uh, quite the broadhead. Uh, this one's made from S7 tool steel. So if I understand correctly, this is the steel they use to cut other metals. Uh, it's literally a tool steel. And these are CNC machined out of a single piece of that S7 steel. So the toughest broadheads uh, that I know of in the world. I don't know how you would make anything uh, a better steel than this. And this is the Bishop S7. And again, a one and one eighth inch, one and an eighth inch cutting diameter. This is the big Mamu right here. This is a monster. I wanted to get this also. It's a 600 grain non-vented broadhead. So this is for big game, buffalo, I mean elephant, hippo, whatever. This, there, any animal on earth, this should do the job. You know, it's, it's awesome. Also, S7 tool steel. Uh, this, these are all made through scientific method. And this one is a 600 grain, non-vented, one and an eighth inch cutting diameter. <clears throat> these are also, these different designs have been tested for long distance shooting. <clears throat> they have, they are very well designed. Here's another one. This is called the Bridgeport. It's made from 41L40 tool steel. There again, lifetime warranty on all these. Uh, it's one of the things it says on this, a 200 grain. One of the things it says on the back, you know, it's like, um, <clears throat> they'll last you your lifetime, your grandchildren's lifetime, and should be your great grandchildren's lifetime. If you don't lose them, they aren't gonna tear up. A matter of fact, they probably won't dull. I mean, it's gonna take a lot to dull these. Uh, they're designed to cut steel. I don't imagine deer hair or uh, fat or anything like that's gonna mess them up too bad. And this is the other one you've probably seen quite a bit on the internet. This is the Holy Trinity broadhead. Also, uh, it's the 41L40 tool steel, CNC uh, made out of one piece. This is a 200 grain. Also made by, these are all made by Bishop Archery. 200 grain, non-vented. <clears throat> Let's see, three by three, 
for a one and one eight cut. So anyway, we'll be getting into this. We'll be doing some testing, shooting different mediums. Can't wait to shoot the, uh, you know, those big bones from the buffalo. Hopefully, we'll be getting. Also, uh, we've got this uh, cold carbon. So this is going to make a really indestructible bond. And he sent me quite a bit of information. You know, you can print this off the internet. You can go to bishoparchery.com. Go to that website and uh, print off. Read. There's some videos. You'll find them on YouTube. A lot of people are, are shooting these now. Uh, you can read all about the tool steels. You know, the pipeline. It's the SR stainless steel. It's a proprietary blend. The bit bridge port is 41L40 tool steel, 55 Rockwell. The Bishop is S7 tool steel, 58 Rockwell. And normally something, a 58 would be brittle. This is not, it's the way it's made, it's not brittle. So anyway, quite a bit of information here. You guys get on the website, check them out. I've spent quite a bit of time researching it myself. These are some of the other heads that are made. <clears throat> the Christmas tree. That's a, I think that's a 600 grain uh, three blade. So anyway, pretty awesome stuff. I haven't shot them yet, so I can't wait. We'll get them out, get them on something. And um, you know, I'll be shooting for sure. If I get a buffalo, we'll be shooting some buffalo. We'll, we'll put some stuff together, wood, whatever, but we're gonna really put them through the test more than you're gonna do on a deer. So look forward to doing that. Y'all look them up. Bishop Archery. They're not cheap. This is something that's an investment. You buy these, you shoot them, and they're they're gonna last you. All right, can't wait to uh, shoot them. Catch you later.